AI that decodes ancient text in Herculean scrolls destroyed in Mount Vesuvius eruption. For 300 years, people have been trying to decipher a set of papyrus scrolls found in a villa owned by Julius Caesar's father-in-law, which have otherwise been completely destroyed in the same volcanic eruption that destroyed Pompeii. Today, these scrolls have been decoded with the help of AI. So get ready as we reveal this monumental achievement that has the potential to reshape our understanding of history. But first, let me give you some context. What are the Herculean scrolls? When the eruption of Mount Vesuvius engulfed the ancient Roman town of Herculean 2,000 years ago, a treasure trove of knowledge lay buried, hidden within the carbonized remains of a luxury villa. 300 years ago, this treasure was found and 800 scrolls were discovered from the only surviving library from antiquity that exists in its entirety. This library belonged to the father-in-law of Julius Caesar, Piso. Piso was a member of the aristocratic Calpurnii family, known for their literary and political achievements. His family's history and his known intellectual pursuits suggest that he may have been well-versed in the classics. What could be in these scrolls? The books present in his villa reflect the complex and changing role of literature in society, ranging from bardic poetry to the works of Philodemus, which are crucial for our understanding of Epicurean thought. In addition, Piso had frequent correspondence with the Roman statesman Cicero, and the Apostle Paul had also passed through the region some decades before the Vesuvius eruption. There may be writing correlated with his visit that comments on Jesus and Christianity. These scrolls could also spill the beans on lost works by Epicurus and his star pupil, Philodemus. Not to mention our beloved poet Sappho and other classical literature heavyweights. It seems we've hit the jackpot for a deep dive into Greek literature and philosophy. The Vesuvius Challenge. This led to the launch of the Vesuvius Challenge, a global contest launched in March 2023 to use machine learning and computer vision to crack the code of the Hercules these scrolls that have been giving historians a headache for centuries. The goal? To go from deciphering a few measly passages to reading entire scrolls easily. And if you think that's cool, get this. They dangle a whopping $1 million carrot for the first team who could recover four passages of 140 characters from one scroll. Such a big reward for reading some scrolls? Dr. Brent Seals acknowledges the significant challenges involved in deciphering the Herculean scrolls. The eruption transformed these scrolls into a log-like structure making their decoding a complex task due to their incredibly compact and intricate internal structure. Even advanced automatic unwrapping computer algorithms have met their match in this endeavor. Adding to the complexity is the fact that both ink and paper of these scrolls are carbon-based, rendering them indistinguishable on x-ray scans, akin to viewing a blank sheet of paper. Contribution of Dr. Brent Seals Meet Dr. Brent Seals, the computer whiz and Pratt alumni professor of computer science at the University of Kentucky. He and his crew kicked out their project on the Hercules in scrolls back in 2002. They managed to crack the code of the Ein Gedi texts using their tech. Before they got to Ein Gedi, though, they gave it a shot in 2009 to decipher the Herculean scrolls with micro CT scan tech. Both these scrolls were all mashed up and tangled, slowing them down big time. Flashback to 2019, they decided to train a machine learning model to read carbonized scrolls using CT scans and texts, enhancing infrared imaging technology. Fast forward to 2023, and their model finally cracked the code. It could recognize ink from ultra high resolution. CT scans they got in 2019. This is when the idea of the Vesuvius Challenge was conceived. Progress of Vesuvius Challenge. This is where Friedman, a Silicon Valley entrepreneur, enters the picture. After watching Dr. Seals talk about Herculean scrolls, he was convinced that he could help in revealing the mysteries of the past. He rang up Dr. Brent Seals with a brainwave, a contest, the Vesuvius Challenge, and funded this grand venture himself. Then he took to Twitter and rallied up some funds. And what did he do next? Hired a bunch of people to play detective with ancient scroll images, cataloging them, segmenting them, and flattening them so that they could be read again after centuries of slumber. Talk about dedication. Thanks to his contributions, a team that works on precision fitting built some cool 3D printed cases. These protected the ancient scrolls during their journey from Italy to England, but they ran into a problem. Making high-res images, cutting them up, and flattening the scrolls resulted in files bigger than expected. So, Friedman introduced smaller prizes for small milestones and a grand prize to the contestant who would be able to decode at least 140 characters by the end of 2023. Crackle Discovery The concept of Crackle was brilliantly conceived by the multi-talented Australian mathematician and physicist Casey Hammer. His individual endeavor was to develop a scroll reading code, but he soon realized that perhaps continuous observation of the image might yield better results. And voila, that's when he discovered the Crackle, a subtle pattern of cracks on the page thought to be created by dried out ink. He posted the findings on the Discord channel of the Vesuvius Challenge in June. This idea was picked up by Luke Ferreter, a 22-year-old undergraduate who was an 
intern at SpaceX at that time. He began to find more crackle patterns and trained his machine model to recognize and reveal the words hidden in that crackle. In early August, he found a new crackle ridge image pop onto the Discord channel of the Vesuvius Challenge. He connected the image with his machine learning model and it was able to decipher 10 Greek letters. Among the letters he found was the Greek word purple. Fast forward to 2023, he teamed up with two brainiacs, Yusuf Nader and Julian Schillinger. Together, they buckled up for an adventure to decode those cryptic Herculean scrolls. In the end, the Vesuvius Challenge received 18 entries for the grand prize. Faraday and his team members were the winners of the grand prize. They were able to decode 15 columns with complete paragraphs from a scroll. Scholars who are still interpreting the text written in these scrolls think it's another piece by Philodemus that focuses on the sensory experiences of food and music. Current work. Only a tiny 5% of the total content hidden in scrolls has been discovered so far. But don't worry, Friedman's on the case. He's passionately redefining what's already been found and is super optimistic about uncovering up to 85% with some exciting new contests. What's more, he's ready to generously fund cutting-edge automated systems that can turbocharge the scanning and digital smoothing process. And if there are any scanners that could be stationed right at the Vila to scan those mysterious rolls, well, he might just snap them up. The Master Plan. After announcing the winners, they also released a blog post with the title, The Master Plan. It discusses the next three stages of the Vesuvius Challenge. Stage 2. At Stage 2, they mentioned the two key problems they could possibly face in unrolling the 800 scrolls. First, segmentation, which is the process of tracing the papyrus surface inside the scan of the scroll. Manual tracing costs up to $100 per centimeter square, which means scanning a 10 to 20 centimeter wide and up to a 15 meter long scroll can cost up to $1 to $5 million. So Stage 2 will focus on auto-segmentation to reduce this cost to $5,000. Scanning can cost up to $30 million, so the aim is to reduce this cost to $5 million. Stage 3 and Stage 4. After segmenting and scanning at least one scroll successfully, Stage 3 will focus on decoding all the 800 scans within 2-3 to three years, while Stage 4 will focus on finding more scrolls by excavating the rest of the villa with political aid. The breakthroughs achieved through the Vesuvius Challenge have opened up new possibilities for understanding the ancient world and its literature with the help of artificial intelligence. Are you excited about this development? Let us know what you think in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and make sure you're subscribed to this channel because we're bringing more informative videos to your doorstep.